boy, I've got a lot to talk about today. Alright, so, hey guys, welcome back, I'm your host Santa Dew, and this is the show, Digi Daily. So, uh, there's a lot to talk about today, we got some really cool news, uh, two pretty, well one's, um, cool, second one's major, 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 major news that we got coming out, uh, or just came out last night, um, so, how about we do this. I'll tell you after I come back. Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to Digi Daily. I said that already, I already gave the intro. I'm just so used to doing it behind the camera. <clears throat> or when I'm sitting down, I should say. Okay, so, <clears throat> let's just get right into it. I'm pretty sure you hear the music. You saw that I have three devices. Or I have all three devices on me. What's going on, you might want to be asking? Well, we got some bad news. Cherubimon, my poor, poor baby, is gone. Now I've lost both of them. Okay, I'm actually, I shouldn't say that because I'm actually pretty, uh, pretty sad about that. Um, so, yeah, um, he at least left the traded egg, so that's, that's good. Um, if I had to uh, say one thing, he fought to the very end. Man, this morning, he was like, doing his death call and I was just waiting on him and it was like taking a while I'm like man this usually doesn't take this long and I was just kind of looking at him you know and I couldn't you know I couldn't flush I couldn't check his uh, I couldn't give him food or anything and the weird thing is I went to light and I just clicked it and it gave me like the on and off option and I went back and he was back to normal so uh, I don't know if that's a bypass I don't know if that's a way to bypass death um, or maybe it was like a little glitch but uh, that happened, but then later on, I checked on him and he was gone. So, uh, yeah. Oops, I hit my camera. Uh, so yeah, that's, that's pretty sad. I'm, I'm, I am sad, I lost, I lost both of them now. But uh, it was a fun run, it was a run I really wanted to do for a really long time. Uh, the other two Digimon I've been wanting to see on a VPET device for quite some time. So it was very fun to run them. But we must move on because the next run is going to be very, very important. Now I know, I'm going to apologize first. I know that I said I was going to do a run and it was going to be a secret. But I'm going to have to put that run off, sadly. Because something very, 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 very important just came out. Stingmon is out. I, I, I usually keep it a secret. Like, oh, there's a new code out and then I'll put it in and then I'll tell you who it is. No, 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 no. None of that. I've been waiting for this for way too long. We're gonna jump right into it. I'm gonna put this code in right the heck now. So, for Stingmon. And this is literally like, I think a few, like two or three days after we just got Cranium on. So I think it's pretty crazy that we're getting codes this quickly. Um, but there might be a reason for that and I'll get into that uh, a little later. Um, I should be able to put in the Digimon code. Yeah, I guess I'll put in the code. Okay, so the code is five. Zero. Three. I skipped three by accident. Three. Three. Six. Seven. I'm going to replace uh, Bethelmon. And we have Stingmon. Oh my god, I'm so happy. Okay, so. What's so important about Stingmon? I've been putting off running the Vmon egg for the sole purpose and sole reason that Stingmon wasn't released yet, and I really want to sh a show off and raise Imperial Drummond Paladin mode. Well, guess who we have now? Guess what I'm running now? That's right, we're running Imperial Drummond. Uh, we're running Vmon, the Vmon egg first. Um, Imperial Drummond Paladin mode is going to be the end game, or the end goal. Uh, so here's the thing. Um, Remember, I was running this, and he's still Agumon. Um, he's got four camera stakes, but he's not a trashy boy just yet. He'll probably be evolving very soon. I'm gonna keep him alive. I'm not gonna be playing with this one anymore, sadly. I'm gonna tab it, because I need this to transfer over a special somebody onto this device. And that special somebody is... 
going to take me a while to get to him. I think you already know who I'm talking about, though. Uh, I'm pretty sure you guys know who I'm talking about. I just told you my endgame. He is pretty far in this. He's pretty deep in here. Uh, 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 mm, mm, mm. Yeah, Omnimon. I raised him on this one uh, because it's the only wave two I have. So yeah, um, that's that's kind of a contingency plan. I'm tired of this thing sitting here doing nothing. I tried tabbing it yesterday and something terrifying happened. First off, um, the screen glitched out, which scared the crap out of me because I thought, oh no, I lost my data. Uh, I put the tab back in, took it out. It was still like glitched out. Like this all was all black, and there's some like, you know, artifacts here. Put it back in, took it out. It was Mastimon, who I never, who I've never raised on this device, by the way, um, with like poop next to it. But it was frozen. This stream was stuck, so I put it in and took it out one more time, and it went back to normal. I haven't unlocked any eggs. Nothing crazy's happened, um, but it's back to normal, and I haven't lost my data, which I'm really happy about. So I'm not gonna try tabbing this anymore. If the battery runs out, the battery runs out, and I'll just replace it. Uh, but yeah, nothing nothing wacky happened. Like, I didn't unlock anything. The names are still Japanese. I didn't unlock any, like, secret eggs or anything like that. Um, I wasn't trying to tab cheat. I was just trying to just simply tab the device, but it wasn't working for some reason. For some, some weird reason. Uh, I, again, I don't recommend tabbing the device at all, because just put. I didn't even press A or anything. I just put the tab in. And when I do that with this one, I put the tab in, and it stops. You know, it stops working. It cuts the contact from the battery to the board, so it just turns off essentially. Uh, on that black one, it was not working and it scared the crap out of me, so not gonna be doing that again. So, boom, let's go all the way to Beamon and wait for that to hatch. While that's hatching, I'm gonna go over here. Now, I said uh, as a contingency, I have the silver, uh, my Zubamon, my golden silver, um, but just in case. Kind of, like, I don't know, like, um, I kind of want to raise Omnimon out here, but, like, I've raised Omnimon, like, so many times now, I'm just kind of, like, over it. I'd rather just transfer Omnimon over, so why not just do something new over here, uh, instead of just doing something I've already done. Um, so, let's do that. Um, got to go to one. The Nature Spirits Egg... Nightmare Soldiers. Actually, let's go with Nightmare Soldiers 20. Which is it the Yin Yang or is it that one? I think it's the Yin Yang. And. Haha! -ha. Uh. I don't know what Vimon's baby is. His baby one. I just realized that. I've never really looked up his baby one. Huh. Um, okay. So, that's uh, our little baby. So, we're gonna go over here. Boom. And we're gonna raise a Pendulum Zero egg. And over here, oh, I can't. I, I that's one thing I don't like about these. I've said this before. I'll say it again. I always complain about it. I don't like the fact that you can't scroll when the egg is hatching. I guess because you're supposed to shake it, because it gives you an extra 10%. But I don't really need it. I've have traded egg stack, and there's a save function on here, so I'm good. Um, that is Metal Choromon. No, Metal, um, yeah, well, Metal Choromon slash Metal Coromon, uh, depends on where you live, and this one's gonna take a while. So, what I'm gonna do, I know I just said, oh, I don't wanna raise up anyone, but I'm tired of, like, I, I like raising two at the same time, uh, I'm tired of just having one and, and one, I feel like it gives me more to talk about and it keeps me on my toes, uh, so we're gonna have, I'm gonna try to raise, um, War Greymon on here, and I'm gonna raise Metal Gururumon here, actually, can I raise my... Oh, he's evolving. I believe it's Yukimi Voltamon. Yes, Yukimi Voltamon. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, so we got. I don't. I don't know what Vimon's. Because I know it's like uh, Demi Vimon, and then it's Vimon. But like, I don't remember his baby one. Um, and then Churomon and. Boom. Okay. So oh, I didn't know that it spins. It's cool. Um, so yeah, uh, I'm gonna try to, even though I just said, oh, I'm tired of running Omnimon, I'm gonna try. <laughs> Why not? Um, and, um, I'm just gonna get the, the logistics of it, I guess you could say, right? Because I want to make sure I can get who I'm gonna say I'm gonna get. Because uh, I know you can get War Greymon on the Metal Empire Egg, um, by just pretty much treating him normally. 
Um, but on the virus busters, can I get a Gururumon? A metal Gururumon? Yes, I can. And it's pretty simple. Alright. Alright, so I can, and it's gonna be pretty simple. So that's what I'm gonna do, because why the heck not? Alright, and we have another metal Coromon. And yeah, this I got a lot of work ahead of me. Tons of work. A lot of uh, things. So, uh, on the Metal Empire, uh, well, no, 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 that's not the Metal Empire, that's the uh, 20th uh, Virus Busters. I'm going to zero effort, I'm going to get two care mistakes. On this one, I'm going to get uh, no care mistakes, and I'm going to treat him really well. On these two, I'm going to treat them really well. So this is going to be the easier one of the two, because all I'm doing here is... Um, treating it perfectly and same thing with the other one so that's gonna be fine oh it's a really nice breeze hopefully it's not loud though um but yeah camera mistakes two camera mistakes zero effort and this one i'm going to have to um oh yeah this one i have to treat well i got it mixed up this one as far as yukimi botamon goes i have to get Zero care mistake. No, 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 no. I think one care mistake. Okay. One care mistake. This is going to be interesting. This is going to be very interesting. Um, okay, so yeah. Um, and we got Omni... Uh, not Omnimon. We got uh, Agumon over here, too. Again, I'm going to tab this. This is going to be a contingency. Um, this was going to be used for a run, but again, I, I got to do this Imperial Dramon Paladin run. Imperial Dramon's one of my... I really like Imperial Dramon. Imperial Dramon Paladin mode's a really cool Digimon. Uh, and it's really cool that I can either use my Omnimon already raised or raise another one. So, sorry um, for dis if it's disappointing. Uh, but more importantly, uh, this guy I'm going to tab, uh, and then he'll come back possibly. Again, he's more of a contingency. It's if I mess up and don't get the right evolutions here, I still have an Omnimon here for later. So that's not the only news we have. Uh, sorry if I took so long talking about this, you're, you're anxious to hear about the new news. So, it's a good time to be a Digimon fan, It, however, it's not a good time to be a Digimon fan's wallet, because holy crap, Bandai has just been just dumping a bunch of merchandise on top of us, and a lot of it ain't cheap. I still haven't even pre-ordered the Wave 2 Pendulums, and they already announced a brand new V-Pet. Now... Back when they were doing the Digimon, the X Evolution poll, they said that these X Evolution, whoever won, which they haven't announced yet, they'll announce it on the 14th of next month, the day before my birthday, coincidentally, um, they're going to announce um, the winner of the X Evolution poll, but they're also, more importantly, going to announce this new, or not announce it, but show off that new device is called the Digital Monsters X. Not the Pendulum X, but the Digital Monsters X. No version 20th added to that. So that seems to me like we're getting a brand new original V-Pet from Bandai. And it's gonna have X Evolutions in it. So I knew that we weren't going to be getting a Pendulum Progress or a Pendulum X 20th. They didn't sell as well. Um, they didn't have a lot of Digimon on them, so I, I, I had a feeling it wasn't going to happen. Um, I didn't know they were going to make their own device, though, or their own new device. So here's a couple things about it. We don't know how it looks yet. We don't know much about it. All we know is just the name and the logo, which I'll be showing. The logo strikes me as interesting because it does not have the Pendulum moniker on it, so that makes me think that this is going to get ditched uh, after the Pendulum 20th. So it looks like they might be going back to how this is where they're... Oh, man, look how blown out that is. I'm sorry. Uh, it's going to go back to how this is where there's no pendulum, it's more button presses. Another thing that strikes me as interesting is it's called the Digital Monsters X and not the Digimon X. Now, there's a reason why I want to harp on that. This is called the Digital Monsters V-Pet. That's what the original ones were called. It wasn't until later they started using the Digimon moniker, and uh, later devices even started using it, like the Digimon XL um, and the Digimon Mini. Um, so what I think is maybe, just maybe, I hope not, uh, it's either A, gonna be a brick, it's gonna look like this, but it's gonna have the X Evolutions in it, 
or B, it's going to be some kind of successor to the original V-Pets with no pendulum, uh, with, I guess, maybe a similar look, but it might have the bigger screens. I'm not too sure, um, but that's kind of like my idea is it's, it might be related somehow to the original Digimon pets because it's called the Digital Monsters X, not the Digimon X, and even the logo is the exact same logo as the original Digital Monsters V pets. So I find that very interesting. Um, maybe they're like reissues of the uh, version 20th because these did so well. Maybe these did better than these. I have no idea. Uh, maybe they'll just be reissues of this with new Digimon in it. I'm hoping for like a brand new device like that they built from the ground up, like it looks new, has a new look, maybe a bit bigger, slightly bigger, not too big. These are a pretty nice size, but you know, slightly bigger with the bigger type screens, better sprites, hopefully, maybe, maybe, possibly a backlit screen, maybe that'd be asking for too much. Um, but I'm very excited, also hopefully it has a two prong connection, which I'm pretty sure it is going to have. Uh, one of the reasons why I knew they weren't going to... One of the reasons I felt like I, they weren't going to do the Pendulum X was because the three-prong connection just kind of cuts off a lot of connectivity to other devices, and it was just not a good move, in my opinion. Because um, at that point, so many people had so many devices that had the two-prong connection. To switch the connector, it just kind of made a lot of things... It just made them obsolete, and it, they shouldn't have been obsolete. They should have at least made some kind of adapter, but no. None of that. Um, so yeah, I'm interested, I'm intrigued, and I cannot wait to see what they're gonna do um, when it comes out, or when they announce it at least. But it's like, it's like crunch time, man. I wanna get the CSM device, the Digivice 1999. I really wanna get the, <laughs> sorry, flipping you guys up. <laughs> I really wanna get two, I really wanna get the uh, Wave 2, at least one color uh, of the Wave 2. And then three, I, want, I definitely want to get the new device. It's a brand new device. It's not going to be anything we have seen before. So, I, I, it's, that's a lot of money. I mean, uh, they did announce that the uh, Pendulum, not the Pendulum X, the Digital Monsters X, I mean, that's going to take a while to get used to. They announced that it was going to be the same price as the original 20th, which I'm happy about. That's a very fair, reasonable price. It's around the same price as the Pendulum 20th. Um, oh, look at him. Demi Vimon. And Yukimi Botamon Digivolves 2. Nyaroman. That's a lot of poop. Did you guys evolve too? No, not yet. Okay, fair enough. So, uh, the Digi <laughs> Digital Monsters X. It's gonna be the same price as these, so that's that's fair. Uh, 50 bucks, that's I, I it's, uh, about 50, 54, I believe it's gonna cost. Um, depending on where you get it, of course. Um, but that's like the around the price it'll, it'll be, and I think it's very fair, I, I, I like that. Um, now I'm just waiting to see how it's gonna look like, who's gonna be in it. And I wanna know who won the contest. I was gonna mention this the other day, because I didn't know when it was gonna end. I was gonna mention like how it was still happening and you guys should go vote. Um, but I, I like, I hope, as dumb as it is, I do. Oh yeah, and then Yaroman again. No, that's not Yaroman. I'm an idiot. Uh, that's it's something. I got the name. You'll see. You'll see the name. <laughs> I'm so sorry. The Pendulum Digimon. I'm, I'm so like very not used to. I'm, I don't know many of them. Even now, which is embarrassing because I've raised. I freeze enough to know. But anyway, um, part of me does hope that. Uh, new Maimon gets an X Evolution because after all this time like it was kind of a meme But then it's like you know what I think it'd be pretty cool to see a new Maimon X Evolution He's been a meme in the Digimon like fandom and community for like so long I think it'd be really cool to get an X Evolution of him Here we go Yay now we got two of the same Digimans We got to treat him differently even though he looks the same um, So yeah uh, I do think that um, it's going to be interesting. I hope whoever wins, I hope their whole line gets the next evolution. It's not just going to be one. I really hope it's going to be like the Pendulum X where like every Digimon on it was an X antibody Digimon. Um, I hope if they introduce a new Digimon, it'll be a natural carrier of the X, of the X antibody, kind of like uh, Odeumon and Alphamon. 
um, that'd be really cool. And uh, again, I hope, I really hope it's like a bigger screen with uh, the de the more detailed sprites. And I do hope it at least has a backlight or something along those lines. That would be great. Um, I mean, I doubt, but one can dream. Uh, so yeah, that's it. I'm done. I gotta get out of here. This episode's gonna be a lot to edit. And uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching, guys. Catch you tomorrow. Get ready because we are gonna get Imperial Dramon Paladin mode. I am so hype. And peace.